at the Eisnocalypse 2011 in Milan and I just want to introduce you somebody new on my interview couch. This is a new couch. You have a new setup as you can see in the background. So what's your name and what you're doing? Well, uh, my name is Ilya, Ilya Terentiev. You may know me as a uh, it's skin, I-T-S-S-K-I-N on iStock, that's how I go. Um, we just set up this really fine studio. <laughs> I am exclusive contributor to the iStock and um, what I really do is um, what I like. And the iStock gives me that opportunity, that's what I do. So um, you told me you're living, you're a Russian, right? And you're living where? Uh, don't be frightened, China. <laughs> Uh, don't be even more frightened, nine years, <laughs> Beijing, uh, so, but, you know, <laughs> different things can happen. And I saw some of your pictures, you have made spectacular pictures from China, actually. So uh, what you're actually shooting, is there any special style or any type of photography you're using or... Well, uh, I started as a usual stock photographer, uh, starting with, you know, general rules, uh, apples on white, and wide backgrounds, such stuff. But eventually I moved to the little bit another style or level or what, whatever you can call us, or not us, it. <laughs> uh, I saw introduce uh, a really high price collections with um, different requirements. Uh, it's not enough to do good isolation, isolation not good enough to shoot nice apple. You have to go above it with uh, some kind of, uh, maybe some unique concept, maybe very unique model, unique styling. Uh, like these collections like trying to value uh, your work and um, trying to pay better for, for what you do because, uh, you know, like, taking a picture of apple, you can do um, I can do it. Yeah, I can do, and they all can do. Yeah. Uh, but sometimes stock photography like stays on this way, stays on the apples, and uh, never goes on. And you are thinking only like very limited way. And what I saw did is uh, introduced Vieta, uh, then introduced agency, and that moved. I think that really expanded the Microsoft. Microsoft way, you know, like uh, what customers can ex accept, uh, not accept, uh, can find on Microsoft. Uh, be before, if you need some special concept, very nice thing, um, you should go to, you know, big guys, Yeti, Alami, or whatever. And iStock become another source, cheaper and not worse. Not not worse. Absolutely. I am. I'm. You know, sometimes I buy photos and. When I search for photos and I don't have the price filter at low price, I always find these nice weather shots and I thought, you know, huh, I just want to buy them, but they're a little bit too expensive for a newsletter anyway, but they look great, you know, if you see them in a search. And I know a lot of photographers, they, they earn quite well from the weather collection. Same for you? Yes. Um, after the weather, my income moved like more than 50% to weather. That's what I do, and uh, sales are not that big. You cannot expect $100 picture to sell as good as a $100, oh, $1, yeah. but uh, it's worth it. It's definitely worth it. And uh, the good thing is, even if you don't sell that much, but you can move forward. You can think about new things. You can invest in shots. Uh, like, if an uh, Apple shot would cost me 500 bucks, I would never go for it, because mm. big competition, a lot of Apple so white, right? So, no way I invest 500, then I get, what, yeah. 10? Or maybe, uh, ju it's just, okay, just my thinking. Yeah. It will, it, it can work for other guys. Like, I shoot millions of apples, you invest 500, and you get millions of photos, and eventually you can sell them, and that's it. But with, I'm, Okay, I am an uh, exclusive contributor and I have to adapt to a new reality. And if I stick with um, General Microsoft, you, uh, you will lost. I would lose. I would Absolutely. Lose. Yeah. I would lose uh, because I am bad at concepts. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, yeah, I know. Yeah. I, 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 Let, no. me yeah, sure. Let me finish. I'm bad at concepts. You can yeah. shoot a very nice and um, unique thing and put it in the main collection for one dollar. But the picture is that good. Uh, concept is that good. Yeah. It does not qualify for Veto Agency. It's okay. something on white. Yeah. But it's so good and you will earn money. Yeah. 
yeah. this way. And I am bad at such a concept. So I have to uh, move to a little bit direction, yeah. and other directions, like I'm good at lighting, I have nice uh, lenses, and I can get nice stylists and um, nice clothing. So I invest a little bit in another thing. So I'm slow on concepts, but I'm good at s s taking beauty beautiful pictures of nothing. <laughs> okay, that's interesting uh, because I saw some of your pictures. You showed them uh, yes. to me uh, a few minutes ago, and in my feeling, you know, in my feeling as a usual iStock customer, just from this perspective, I had the feeling that you are strong in concepts because your concepts are different than the others. You know, because you get really bored if you see the same concepts over and over. And what I can see in your pictures is that they're different. Uh, I don't have any concepts. Actually, in my pictures, yeah. there are pictures of uh, landscapes, no concept there. Yeah. I just do landscapes my way, yeah. or I'm doing a beauty shots, but not real beauty, yeah. just, uh, you know, yeah. <laughs> some kind of lifestyle mixed with beauty. Uh, no concept there, just nice girl standing. Okay, yeah. That's okay. it, but I add um, like another value to them. For example, I can go and shoot with a film. A lot of people will say, no, it's uh, not worth it. Uh, you will, you can do or simulate with uh, digital. Yes, and they would be right. But for example, shooting film, don't let you instant previews, makes you think before you shoot. Because you just have, well, okay, 10 shots in a roll. Yeah. Or if you shoot with big camera, you just like <laughs> one and that's 10 bucks. <laughs> and you think 10 times or 20 times and then you take a picture. And eventually you come back with not 1,000 picture uh, in your card, but maybe with 10 on the roll yeah. and five of them are good. Yeah. And you can come with a thousands of digital and all of them are bad. So just you limit yourself then. Uh, it's not limiting, it's uh, limiting, yes, 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 you, you go for this, to limit yourself, to think more, push yourself, yeah. okay, let's try. And uh, coming back to the girl standing in nowhere, yes, it's a nice girl, but it's done like with film and uh, with uh, nice lighting before I saw it, like one week about that. No concept, but nice picture. And, and that can sell, and it is selling good. Okay, so you, actually, what's your recommendation if you if I'm a usual micro stock photographer okay so I'm the guy who's shooting apples okay I'm you know not me but <laughs> just a recommendation a guy who's shooting apples on the white shooting models on the white and doing different stuff like the usual stuff you know the usual micro stock stuff and he earns some money okay. so what's the next step he needs to take to make sure he earns more sells more sells better well mine mine not like I, mean, I can be wrong but first stop shooting apples uh, immediately stop shooting hand holding business stuff it's over developed market if you're a customer uh, you can go and find millions of this you don't like this angle oh, okay 10 and others you don't like this uh, shirt no way you go millions and it is easy to say, to say, do something different, this is something original, very hard. You have to find your way, you have to, I think you should experiment. Uh, you should try different things, don't stick with, um, don't read too much internet. <laughs> That's a good recommendation, don't read my blogs. Yeah. No, I'm just curious, it, it, absolutely, it's a, a lot of people reading too much and going less out and shooting. Uh, yes, and uh, don't take um, equipment seriously. Don't, I tell you the truth, I had all Canon lens you can possibly own, with some exceptions, like, and it, the thinking was, I'm taking shit pictures because I don't have this 85 1.2, and I bought it finally, and I sh showed the sh same shit, but with better bokeh, you know, it doesn't make any difference. <laughs> I like it, it yeah, that, it, it, it's, it's really true, it's true. Yes, absolutely. Um, Okay, so general recommendation, go buy a field camera with fast lens, Spockmatic F, classic one, all manual, no auto, no auto, and uh, with nice Takumar 51.4. That's it, try it, 
uh, you fail, no worries, you sell it or you throw it away, 200 bucks. But that was the thing that moved, pushed me forward. So it's like the new, I have just saw some of the Fuji X100, something like that, more or cheaper one like that. You limit yourself a little bit more and make sure you take better pictures or? Fuji, do not limit you. Fuji is very nice. It's 1,000 bucks. I had them once. <laughs> yes, and uh, it's very easy. It's, all, it's, yeah. uh, it's not limiting. It's also digital. Millions and can be shipped. Yeah. So, I mean film. You, okay. Film. Okay. Really, okay. Take it. Uh, you will, what, what you will do, you will value your, your time mm -hmm. as a photographer because you go out with a roll of film mm -hmm. and um, you are kind of taking pictures, thinking about them, something, and you know if you fail, then you fail during the shooting, fail during developing, fail during the scanning, and this is all time, a lot of time. And time is money. You fail one time, next time you go, you think different. different. Yeah. Instantly. And then when you come back to digital, yeah. it's like, wow. <laughs> no. That's a good recommendation. Really. I, you, you just try, you know? I maybe try that, and for you, you just try that there. Maybe it won't work for uh, Shutterstock or something where they love, you know, blurred and uh, killed all the noise. But maybe for yourself, uh, iStock will take it. If you are independent and you come with film shots, grainy, but with a concept, welcome. They are very open guys. And, uh, my, okay, my wife uh, right now is trying to do something. And um, she tried, okay, she's iStock, Shutterstock. She's independent, so... And what she shoot with my recommendation get rejected everywhere, everywhere except us. <laughs> so that's a good recommendation, I think. Absolutely. I don't think uh, that's a good recommendation because you don't want to be. The thing is, just that you try it and this. You try it. Try it and get better by using film. Yes. That's a, that's a new recommendation to me. Yes. Uh, you will think differently. Yes. And uh, film, film camera, and uh, don't read any of that. Do your do your stuff. Don't look too much to others' portfolios. And, and, and absolutely, don't watch too many interviews. Yes, of course. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you can close the page right now yeah, and think. Please close it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what that talking about. But I think they can help. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. And okay, that, that's, that's from uh, I saw <laughs> Thank you.